Hi, this is Michael, and this is my review of the Go-To Belt. Now, I have two of the buckles here. This is the Malibu buckle. It's silver nickel in color, and this is the Newport buckle. And this is a really innovative and very, very cool belt. One of the reasons I love this belt is because it doesn't use the conventional holes through it. It uses a track on the back which is in one quarter inch increments. So you can get a very precise fit with this belt. And if you just need to adjust your belt a little bit, uh, you can just easily do so. Um, the belt fits into the buckle very securely. And there's this uh, little lever here that has little sharp teeth on it. And you stick the end of the belt in there and clamp this down and it is not gonna slip out of there. There's no way. Also, this is great when you're giving it as a gift because uh, just one size you don't know you don't know have to, you don't really have to know the person's exact size because the back of the belt is marked in one inch increments and they can just cut this to fit them. Um, it's always easier to cut a little more material off the belt, uh, but if you cut it too short the first time, well, that's what you're going to end up with. So to properly size this belt, attach the buckle to the one end and wrap it around your waist just like you'd normally wear the belt. And then you want to leave about uh, oh, a couple inches past the first belt loop and, uh, and then just make note of how long that piece is. And then go back to your belt, uh, take uh, the buckle back off it, and then just get a really sharp pair of scissors and cut right along the marking that you need. And if you're in between a mark, that's perfectly fine as well. And then the way the buckle goes on is you just insert that cut end into the end of the buckle and flip this little lever down and push it down firmly. And that is in there for good, uh, well, until you release this, but it's very, very secure in there and it will not slip out. Uh, this is the black belt. It's top green cowhide. Uh, it's a very flexible belt. It's not really thick and stiff like some of the more inexpensive belts that you'll see out there. And um, there is the indication that it's top grain leather. And um, I just really, really like this belt. Now this belt is one and a quarter inches wide. Uh, you may have seen the track line belt, which is extremely similar to this belt. Uh, the track line belt is a little bit wider. And uh, I find that this belt, the go-to belt, does fit through my pant loops a little bit better. But you can see the slight difference in width there between the two belts. Uh, even though they look like they're the same buckle and belt, uh, they, they aren't. So you cannot interchange the buckles between the track line belt and the go-to belt. Uh, these belts are only one and a quarter inches wide, whereas the track line belts are one and three eighths inches wide. But uh, I really like this belt. Just as a point of reference, I have been wearing this belt for several months, and it has held up very well. Uh, I mean, it's perfect. It, it fits well, and I just love how this goes around my waist and clicks into place. So let me just show you how that works, and just insert the belt into the buckle, and it just clicks into place. Quarter inch increments. And to release it, you just push this little button here and it comes right out. Really like the belt. And if you have any questions, leave a comment. I'll answer it if I can. Otherwise, thanks for watching. Have a great day.